Hello guys and welcome back to a new video. In this video I'm going to show you how to create consistent characters for free with Canva and TensorArt. So just please follow my steps until the end and let's begin the tutorial. And so easily what we're going to do here, we'll go and open our browser and then we'll go for Google and once we're on Google we're going to search for TensorArt. And here we go for this website and we need to create an account or log in with an existing account already. And as you can see here I have an account. So once we're here we're going to click on models. And here we can choose between all of these models as you can see here so in my case i would like to go with this style over here which is lucy dream and i click on the style or i can click on run over here to create my own so here we have already text to image image to image animate and so on easily we'll go for text to image and go for it exactly and we're gonna write i want a girl eating ice cream wearing a dress and make it on 3d effect and here we have more options as you can follow but in my case that's pretty good for me and also we have here portrait landscape square or custom and lastly we have more options and so on but these are not necessary to follow up so just click on generate and so here we have the final results so we're going to click on download over here and once the picture downloaded we'll go to google and we're going to search for remove background and we'll open this website over here and once open, we're going to drop the image to this place over here to remove the background of it. And click on download over here. And last step, we'll go and open Google. We're going to search for Canva. And we'll open this website here for Canva. And from here, I click on create a design. I'm going to search for A4, which stands for A4 paper. And I click on document A4 portray. And now from here, I'll go down a little bit and I'll go for apps. And I click on apps. And I'll search for magic media. So over here, click on Magic Media and write Garden or whatever you like to, but I prefer to create Garden and click on Generate Image. So I'll pick up, for example, this one. I'll take it here and I'll put it in the middle and just like to make the picture looks bigger and better to fit all the document. In last step, I'm going to do here, I'll go to Uploads and I'll click on Upload File and I'll upload the picture that we downloaded from the website and I pick it over here and I'll make it on this way for download or upload it or upload it on Canva and I'll pick it over here. That's how we can create this tutorial. At the end, that was all today's video. If you find this very helpful, please don't forget to like the video, subscribe to the channel, and thanks for watching.